Hey everybody, my name is Hayden. Um, little, got a little story to tell you. So, uh, around yesterday, uh, mid afternoon ish, I had just got like this really bad pain in my back. Uh, I wasn't feeling good. I was super, super tired. Uh, yeah. So, because of the pain in my back, I know that muscle pains, muscle aches, and stuff are a symptom of COVID. <clears throat> so today I went and I called my doctor. I was like, yo, what do I do? So you said I went and get tested. I don't think I have it because I'm feeling better today, but um, he told me I should get tested. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm getting tested tomorrow morning. I uh, just figured I'd document the experience. Um, yeah, show you guys what it's like to get tested for COVID. So uh, that's all I have for today. I'm quarantining from the safety of my room, even though I'm outside at the moment, uh, quarantining to the safety of not around other people. So, yep, that's it for me. I will check back in on my way to the testing center tomorrow. And I'll explain the different ways of testing that they have around me. And I'm guessing that they probably have around everybody else too. So I'll explain that either later on tonight or tomorrow. So see you guys then. Hayden T Tech, H A Y D E N T E T E A K. Date of birth? Uh, April 1st, 2002. April 1st, 2002? Yep. Hello. Hello. And your name? Hayden T Tech. Hayden? H A Y. Oh, Hayden. Yep. H A Y. Yep, D E N. Last name T E T E A K. Ooh, that's okay? yeah. <laughs> All righty. All right, you good to go. Awesome. Thank you so much. You too. All righty. It's a it's a couple minutes after you guys saw that clip of me getting tested. Um, right now I'm just chilling in the parking lot because my mom's going through. Ugh. Uh, getting tested as well just to be safe and only one person per car so um, but that had to be one of the most unpleasant experiences of my life it didn't hurt so to say but having something shoved that far up your nose isn't a pleasant experience um, yeah, so um, with the private lab, the reason I did this one is because the turnaround time, I'll have my results in 72 hours, so um, within 72 hours. Um, yeah, uh, my brain's fried at the moment. <laughs> uh, yeah, so COVID test, we're done. We're waiting for the results. Uh, not a super pleasant experience since they have a little little thing they shove up your nose but uh yeah we're done we did it we'll have my results in 72 hours um i'll probably post this video before i get my results back so uh follow me on social media and if my test comes back positive then i'll probably say something on there uh links to my social media will be down below or I'll maybe make a second video uh, if my test does come back positive but I'm not super feeling like it is but never know uh, my symptoms haven't changed too much I still feel pretty much the same uh, back hurts a little bit and then I just feel super tired so uh, I don't think I, I still don't think I have the virus but doc wanted me to get it tested so that's what we're doing um, like I said I'm gonna explain the three way or that I said that there's three ways to get tested 
near me at least. Um, the first one is you can go to the public testing facilities. Um, so the way you do it is you just look at your state's Department of Health website uh, and there should be a list of testing locations and how to sign up through there. That option is completely free. Um, the turnaround time from what I'm hearing, don't quote me on this, it's about a week or so. So um, if you need it fast, that's my, may or may not be your best option depending on where you live at. Um, second option is you can go to a place like CVS, Walgreens, I think they're all doing them. Um, but their turnaround time is like two weeks. Uh, once again, it's free, but um, two weeks, it's just not practical. Um, or the third one is there's private labs at least um, by where I live that are doing it. So right now I'm actually heading to my church and they have a lab group set up there. This one though is not free. This is 150 bucks, but as long as you get told by your doctor or medical provider to do it, I'm pretty sure that you can get reimbursed on your insurance. So uh, take all of that with a grain of salt. I am not the person you want to talk to. If you think you have COVID, call your doctor. Don't listen to me, uh, but that's what's around me. All right, so that's it for me today, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, that's how you get COVID tested. That's what it's like. That's the whole experience, baby, from step one to step till it's over. <laughs> uh, but that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to start posting more frequently on this channel. So if you want more content, follow me. Peace out, everybody.